Okay, here's a little video that I'm making to show the uh, oil drain backs on my Ram Air 5 head. Um, show how efficient these things are. This has got this in our parts uh, washer solvent tank. And of course solvent's a little bit thinner than oil, but it gives you a good idea how well the oil returns on these things. Uh, we got the head set up at like about a 45 degree angle like on an engine block. Uh, sorry about the air, uh, air bubbles in that there. It's hard to see the valve guides in this one here on this end, but you can see on this end, this is the low end too. This isn't the high end, this is the low end. And still the guides are barely, I mean I don't think they're going to be covered up in an engine, engine running. Uh, because you're not going to get this kind of volume of oil from the rocker system and the push rods. So if it drains back with this, I'm sure that we're going to have be plenty have plenty of oil return with rocker set up in there. That's the oil coming out of the uh, where the oil re, uh, return is in the cylinder head on the bottom side, and it exits right here by this bolt hole on the end. If I turn this. Uh, pump off here you can see that we have the the head studs are in here we're simulated just like it would be on an engine it's hard to see with this lighting but uh, there is a stud in there we radius the oil hole or oil uh, passage back to the return so that uh, oil can get back there easier. But I just thought I'd show everybody that. Uh, a lot of people are concerned about that but it uh, it's more than adequate for most engines.